not the meta, right? It can be countered a lot easier, I think. And right. I think just raise in general. On this okay, map so the KO reasonable. Gecko comp we'll see if he's any good against the Phoenix one, he can of Loud. Loud on defense, NRG on but, attack, yeah. Again, and a, a treat. three We've ghosts and one frenzy. I have a good idea that he's gonna be pretty nice. I think I think you can put Demon One on anything from what we've seen, and he'll be adequate, and maybe a little bit more than that. <laughs> Astro Omen, whatever, you know. NRG on the attack. You see Wingman already going. Oh, that shock dart damage is big. That paranoia is certainly gonna help uh, Demon One it's already. a good plant, and they <laughs> have the smokes. First. It's the done rounds, nade. probably. That was a free one, too. His two he's couldn't see a dang thing. He's gonna try to fight back with Yeah, we gotta keep are. an eye on Marv there. Yeah. She's swinging out. Oh. oh, Two big kills, flirting with the third. And Marv smokes himself Ultimately off. It's just a spam it. fest. It does worry me a little bit in the pistol, but They're I've seen it work before. Sadak trying to creep his way out, trying to find a kill with the Frenzy and cannot. Less now in a 1v2. Cam cleared. Yeah, and he hasn't gotten that far. Victor's just playing with him. Playing with his food. There's a swing out. <laughs> okay. Nicely done. It's the classic B plant. It's hard to lose it if you play it right. Nicely done from NRG. That is three out of three pistols. That we're seeing now in this, like, this new and improved NRG is their trading is so much better. Like, Victor just getting this trade on, on Kawazin. Huge. And then just jiggling this. They're playing these scenarios in the post plant so well. And I think that's just a time thing. Like, I think it's just the synergy is a little bit more there. And I still Come don't on, think it's right there. fully there either. I would agree. And that's scary for other teams. What is this? A late swing over towards the middle? Or are they... Here we go. Just a nice slow mid default. Not trying to get cheesed by any deagles like they did Wait, on Breeze. The timing on this is pretty good from QCK. QCK. Were you Insanely good. So much info gathered from him. Hey, they've cleared so much space. QCK, you mentioned him coming oh, no. not far off. <laughs> That's wild. The like most perfect the timing you could down, ever have down. for this. Oh, and he just gets sat down. We got, we got to see it through the wall. You remember here oh, for loud, good. they didn't invest very much at all. A little bit here, a little bit there. You've got a share for Kawanzine and for less. Mm -hmm. A ghost for two E's, but... Yeah, I mean, it's always great when you can get a kill in and of the artillery anything that else on him. This will be a difficult one to pull off. Although, we did Phoenix. see... What is that bounce of the nade, man? On Breeze, so so unlucky. We'll see how it plays a bit too high. Oh my gosh. All right, never mind. Five. I think we're clear. Yeah. <laughs> Crashies, two away from his, nice. Victor two away from his ult. Shots. Speaking of ults, Victor has his ult, so if they get a pick, it's pretty important in terms of being able to make an instant decision. Yeah, Loud need to make sure they don't give them a pick, yeah. This is his first appearance on Raze. Isn't that insane? That's just wild. And I gotta point out, Crashies is already like two orbs well, I'm away from the 278 ult, the games. the Gecko on this map. You can literally farm this Gecko ult, maybe in half, have like three, four, a half. It's it's kind of nutty, and we've already seen like Sa Saucy do it. Yeah. We've seen PRX use the gecko on this map. It's quite good because you can pick up the utility after you clear space, and also you don't have to plant the bomb yourself. You can just use that little gecko to plant for you while you just hold. Right there. And you need that against a retake comp like this. You see the ping on the mini map just on the other side of the wall. They realize there's a pocket there from Les as well, and it's actually Demon 1 who fills that space for now. And the thing is, okay, they're mid really default, patient about they insert one over towards to top mid. They'll be able to hear some rotates with this as well. Now they want to push back loud. Special We're holding one person over towards way. A. Energy, their a nice toward default deck. at the moment. We are walking oh gosh, in towards tiny. market. Oh, Holy. Yeah. Yeah, so they make. Do they so even make clean. sound over towards A? I'm not even sure. To do with Raze, but yeah, he could that was Raze. sick. Just felt like he had a timing. It is a bonus <laughs> round. <laughs> Lovely. <laughs> Cypher all invested just to secure the W. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was going to happen. Too. <laughs> Two E's managing to stabilize, and Cullen Zine there to help. Remember on Breeze, there was a massive bonus. Good, uh, a little bit harder for them to win up. this one. Obviously, they got no vision block. Or I say the is they throw some vision block down in terms of the cage. They do well, have Fischl as well if they want to. And you've got, got a Dizzy next as well. Keep things back. This is this feels borderline impossible if you're loud. Oh, yeah. 
taps through, and Dizzy's there's not going to find anything because of smoke, but you're right. There's the ult. Demon 3 yeah, with Demon 1 with the round. It's all great at the <laughs> moment. Brand, though. As oh. Tui's is left alone. He's got a tuck tail. He's got to get out and save that Vandal. Dre, talk to me as we see this round expire. What a, what a sick round talk from Demon 1 here. The, the what is this? Of being up this big. I don't know what the cue for him to move there was. I swear they didn't even make sound over towards A. Just straight up went. Maybe he's heard something? It's, it, is a, it is just a snowball. You get more confidence because you're not scared to lose your weapons, right? So if you're, if you're um, not scared... That shot is insane. Oh, sorry, these are beautiful shots. That's terrifying. He timed it perfectly, by the way. Uh, if you're not scared to lose guns, you're going to take more risks. Yep. And if you're confident in those risks... I mean, you just saw Demon 1 just walk straight into the market right there and just get a free 2k. It's fearless. This is a nice spot. 6-0 for Victor, 5-1 for Demon 1. And the buy for Loud, not great. Tui's has a rifle. And you got, you got less, he's taking a little bit of space too. Yeah, he's so pushed up, but he only has a Deagle. Yeah, but the thing is, that camp can and he hears so much that the oh, way, right yeah, the way these guys are jumping oh, around here, they have literally no idea that he managed camp. to get into that What's corner the of the cam. From NRG, they're gonna try to reclear it. Not letting Les have this gun, I think, is really important. Yeah, Push just throw it out the map. Throw it off there the it map. Goes. And that's yeah, an upgrade too. I think Crashy's had a guardian right there. So they managed to keep their prize possession, keep it out of the hands of Loud. And we saw how they good push back to A, it. they hear the fake run off, so and they're actually close. Here. Contact, oh, tuck in, flash, yes. double peek. Kalanzine has his fault line oh. too. If there's enough of a queue, he can turn onto this very quickly. <gasps> but they they had a really good setup. Flashes. They messed up. They don't up. really show anything. That paranoia. I mean, there could have been a footstep, but it felt like a timing thing. And yeah, maybe the they didn't mess up. That was huge. Two, he's getting his kill and then getting out. They push down. So into, I mean, really Lester shoots them all in the yes, back here. Oh man, where do I talk? Dude? It's just outrageous. How does that even happen? They're not looking at him. Yeah. It may not have been the kill, but he did get some damage done. Now Sada. Nah, they can't win this round though. Little bro, and he can't. Demon one there to greet him. Crash. He's swinging back side. Oh my goodness, what's going on? The job was done. He's got a raise, nays. 63 HP as the spike ticks away, eight bullets. That's all it is. QCK on the flank, Tui's was there on the first. Crashy's left alone. They're patient with this. Oh, I can't believe he didn't land that shot. Tui's with three on the round, loud on the board. I don't know. I don't know what's going on. That was all off of what Les did, taking all that aggro space into that B main area, understanding that energy hasn't really been pressuring that area too much in the previous rounds and understanding that they like to take mid. So he found the perfect timing to finesse this cam. Never saw him. Up, yeah, it opened up the entire round for them. I then not only that, and then you remember the damage that was dealt mid, right? Delayed the rotation yeah. just a little bit, set up Sadak to get the shock dart kill. You know, Sadak gets so much value from the shock darts, even if it's just chip damage. Yeah. Hey, he pretty important rounds, down. considering the money's this low. Be the first raise rocket we see out of Demon One. Big reset. If he chooses Recon goes round. over towards A, clears yeah, everything. With that, Demon they straight up just gamble stack. That it's not going to be a Rosa. Towards mm -mm. <laughs> Waiting, bated breath. Just knowing that the they're satchels. most likely never going to disrespect an Omen one way. There it Here is. We go. Well, that was underwhelming. Oh, oh wait. <laughs> he got out, though. <laughs> was it? <laughs> no, Rosa! And he gets a second kill. Oh, boy. Phoenix all oh, close. Yeah. That's a round for NRG. This is a good ult in the sight. end. Took so much space. Success rate. That's not bad. <laughs> I could never personally. <laughs> <laughs> Loud calling a timeout. I'm out. They, they got a low buy. They won away from a lot of ults. And Doug. <laughs> That's unfortunate. That's, that so sad. Just trying to throw a smoke. But back to what I was trying to get at.
Very good. Invented. Sentinel's taking over the reins of that. And now NRG playing it, but, you know, it might be the same comp that they're playing against, but not every team plays it the same way. Right. That's be having none of it. That's Respect. what's so unique about the game of Valorant. So many ways you can play and approach certain things. Two rifles for the defense, one for two E's. Okay, for like we said, low money on this We've one, but this next big buy round is going to be, I mean, a lot of ults. Right. They still have Fischl. Well, they came up fast. Oh, that's a mid Dude, everyone just gets three Fischl's a half, I swear. Even I when they're, they're not stacking it. This. They're just going to commit to the B site here. <laughs> oh my god. That's the thing about there's some of the value that I just one taps Phoenix, everyone. Like, yes, there was help over the top, and that was the cue for him to take the flash and then swing. He's gonna get more. He's gonna Whoa. get more. QCK with three finally. Holy dude, I can't get over how stacked the server is. It's insane. The instant round the world is really strong as well, and the fact is that Crashies has a lot of util, right? He can jump, throw his molly, then he can do his dizzy like we saw earlier. Then they're just going to heavy focus on this, and then the flash comes in, and now they're focusing heavy on this guy, and then the scythe could just shoot him both in the side. Oh, boy. <laughs> oh, no. What? full <laughs> It's so stupid, man. <laughs> everyone's everyone's too good at the game. A little bit unlucky for uh, Victor, though. Bro, I felt like four people had a ridiculous round. That gecko all saves the day. Maybe he would have gotten all. I mean, all five members. He showed no signs of slowing down. <laughs> Demon One has been a menace in this series with the first bloods. I think last map alone he had seven, and I'm already. Oh man, the money's really high on NRG. This is this is starting to get way too one-sided. They got to win this round. Oh man, Marv just like insta walked through long middle. Long He's long here, time. in the dudes. Oh my gosh, it's beautiful. <laughs> oh, and the breach and the breach all came out. Chat. He's top middle in the first ten seconds. The big buy round. Distraction over towards A. They try and make it look like a fast hit with loads of U2 and he just scary. walks straight <laughs> into middle. If I'm other VCT teams watching and he this got right the now. breach all out. Oh. I've never seen someone one tap as much as this guy. I mean. And they scream. I thought we'd have a massive fight on our hands. All the one taps. Balao, just it. I know it's early on sunset, but it feels like they left. A lot of what they had cooked up on Breeze. And it's tough, man, when you've got Demon 1, Crashies in, Vic at the top of the scoreboard, and then Marv just starting yeah. to get online and making big plays like that. <laughs> it's insane. I mean, Fast brother accuracy is thing through the roof. Right Dead, now. right? I mean, it's, oh, it's okay, insta. As soon as oh, no, it is insta. Headshot. Yeah. There. Dude, what a play from Marv. What a play from Marv this was, by the way. Have the confidence to do this, and this was just a cool round overall as well. That was such a good setup, but this the distraction was sick. But three people in on all is way too much. He got, he got everything. aggressively TPing, aggressively taking space, getting behind enemy lines, finding timing windows, and so early on too, to be able to get that read with only like what six rounds in in, in play. Yeah. And it's not like he's been like lurking around in mid for like most of the of the game. Yeah. I mean, they've been hitting B, they've been doing some pressure on A, and they've had Demon 1 walk into mid. And I think maybe it was somebody that was just saying, you know, like, hey, like somebody from the roster, like, hey, take the uh, Jimmy, I think you could take this timing top mid. Okay, bet. He found it. <laughs> <laughs> bet found. You sounded just like a boy. <laughs> Energy of lean towards A for the majority of this round. They take a, uh, they take a B, well, could be interesting. Really have much to fight back with. Can have a jump spot and then look at the space, and you see what the trap setup is already comes. Is rotated back A in case someone hits with two E's taking contact. There's really there's the contact. Less can take contact. You see this though, right? You see the, the layers, right? They've got traps. Yeah. Everything is a little bit considered. Especially with the wall that got honestly, they didn't put this wall up. I think there's more chance that they don't check it. Now they probably check. Energy. They should hard clear this, and they do. And more. <laughs> Again, Wait, where did the KO flash come from? He committed the ult. 
Colantine and Tui's left alone. A stinger and a ghost. I got you, I got you. I gotta say it. These rounds honestly have not been very close at all. No. This is very convincing so far. Yeah, it is convincing. I don't want to rule that out because you could never rule them out. They're resilient. Uh, I mean... That's mm, one of the traits that... I think there was a few, but... Aware of. <laughs> you know what else? Can everyone I look at is just eating Sleepy KO flashes. And jet lag. That is very true. And you kind of wonder, like, how much of that is having an, an impact on the situation. Running out of gas a little early, perhaps. But you're right. We've seen loud in positions like <laughs> this. We've seen so many people in chat who haven't, like, piped all day. Right just going in for desk. Everyone sure. chimes in. All it takes is a couple of rounds to string together. That's crazy. But energy's not making it easy for them. Not getting thrifty. Understanding that if a thrifty comes through, this might be another, another close game. Like that first map. With all the absolute savages. Even the YouTube chat. Another timeout. That's their second. <laughs> First time chat. They have a lot of ults to work with. So Dude, Bren's here as well, man. Bren's been lurking the whole time. <laughs> he just gets involved. On one side of the map, and then a trap play on the Guys, other side. Guys, PC's just broken. Up into play. Maybe we'll see a little pocket strat with the breach stun. <laughs> yeah, had, like you came into the stream just for cool. it. Yeah, well, That's I do funny. think, like, for loud, we've seen them try things like that. We've seen them try things like <laughs> that a lot. Yeah. Again, everything has a, a consideration to it. Everything has contact and then a swing or contact and then a trap, things yeah. like that. And they just haven't really come to fruition for loud. And then I also think worth noting <laughs> for for that side of the stage. The late timeout. The wheel, say the that much. That, both timeouts called. I mean, no, wait, they called one early. earlier. Early. Take that back. I take it back fully. They, they understand they need to salvage this half if they want any chance to win it. Yeah. Yep. By the Actually, a very it, early timeout for the second right timeout, to be fair. And I want to point out again, guess what? Yeah, point it out. Crashies has another ult. It's third <laughs> third of the half, if I'm not mistaken. I mean, this is... It's just so insane. And he only has three more kills than the last time. But it's just... That's how easy it is to farm this ult. Mm -hmm. Especially when you have someone like Demon1 just getting the first blood every single round. And mm -hmm. just giving you the 4v5. Giving you the site for free. 12 and 4. For okay, timeout. Big so change up is uh, Omen off for sure. They have a lot of ults know, to play with as well, so this is by far their best chance. Ethan one away from his ult, though. Could cancel all of this. I know it's just one map. It hasn't even been a full half, but he's certainly there. answering a lot of the questions and silencing a lot of the doubters. Oh! Damn, that is unlucky raised. timing. Lovely. Whoa. Victor not able to turn on Coentine. All the info gathered here, though. The entire map is their just playground right now. They can do anything. They're, they're aware of where Loud is. And I want to point out as well, I feel like NRG... I just feel like the timing on this luck is going to be incredible. And it's been working very I well. I don't blame them. It's like the only time we've seen less... Get on like the good plan, they just check... In Blood that, that was kind of nice. Just an ult to just make sure that no one's going to rush in to stop the, the plant, secure the plant, pick He's it back up. Behind enemy lines. Yeah, keep an eye on the omen. We've got to keep an eye on the, the viper as well. They're expecting the viper. They're not expecting this omen. Does he wait for two? This is this is a scary sight because oh I've seen it go God. wrong, but this time it goes well. I mean, Les did the same thing back. As soon as the star heats up, the counter punch is there, but now one v one left. Marved has been good. The tap is there. The snap is to the right. Lovely from Marved. I mean, both of them did great. Marved did really good uh, trigger discipline here. Nothing going the way of loud right now. And they still have four Arch King, dude, he's been having mad impact, right? I spoke about it. The trading has been just crazy from NRG. Even yeah. getting the insta trade off a of demon one there, and then even flicking the guy top mid. Wow, that was, that was lineup. I just as Les gets to Marv responds to two of his own. No emotion. <laughs> oh, I think that was him smiling. <laughs> Seven rounds for the Still. attack side. An ult in the hands of Demon 1. We'll see if he's able to keep up that streak. That was almost dangerous. A little pre fire almost connecting. Dude, Victor's taking. <laughs> Dude, Victor to wants to go. There. There's no cue to flash. <laughs> yeah. yeah, taking the risk so that Razor can get over towards the site. Connects. Two for two. Sonic's there on the trade. The spam through. He's so weak. Ultimately falls. Energy once again in firm control of the round. A guardian up and a stinger to boot. I just can't with this gecko, Doug. I just, I just can't. Hundred percent. He's already 
more than ratio. Yeah. yeah, you're right. I mean, it's just and he might get more. Yeah, I mean, if, if he cleans up these kills, he's he's one off. See if we can get our how many. Do you think we can find how many ults, how many gecko ults have ever been used in half, like the most amount? <laughs> That'd be crazy. Even the flash that, into the smoke. Uh, he's certainly pushing it. Oh, that yeah, that she looked really good in this map. Having it online again. <laughs> and a lot of success from NRG has been walking into space and not allowing these traps to be set off by utility being used. And then you, you see it, right? PCK is walking up to get the set up the flash, and he just gets picked off because he's not aware that Victor's already walked up. Yeah, there's no safety valve. All right, yep. there's nothing to allow him to get into that position and be the cue for him to flash. This is good prep work from NRG. They definitely did their God, own I did that. I would be tempted to pop some of these ults instant. Are built. So walking into a lot of this space on the timings they're doing, it's not just by coincidence. They know what they're doing. That certainly seems like they know what they're doing. Up eight rounds. Cloud have found very little to... The I mean, person committed no is the Phoenix, though. At this point, just pushing all the way up B main here with a one-way. Oh my! They're just starting to. They don't know. Um, this. They don't know about no idea. <laughs> the QCK falls. The victors. Uh, their confidence is too much. Now they I respect the going in though from this. Grab this B main orb if they wish. Cam was broken though, so maybe second guessing themselves. Nope. Abrahama, thank again. you very much, man. Appreciate the tier one. Surely we grab thank you so orb. much, dude. Oh, it's already, it's already, already taken. Around, yeah. Yeah. It's already taken. Okay, that's fair. Go get Marv again. Um. Mid area of the map. Oh, 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 recovery. Ethan once again on the trade crash. He swings what? out, <laughs> deciding he didn't want the fight. Throws it in reverse and gets out. That's because Marv is so far Surely up. Not. Is everything. Oh Tough boy, that's an open sight. And just like that, the map is wide open. Ah, it's oh, such a good idea God. to go spawn. He's, he's just a freak. He's a menace. <laughs> he's a freak. He's an absolute menace. <laughs> you see the pings on the mini map. Understanding. <laughs> so good. There's a real good chance he's taking that timing, and they're right about it. Yeah, and they could, they just have everywhere locked off no so line. early. Hey, we have Gecko ult again. That's actually that's actually <laughs> insane. The reposition from the Yeah, the Gecko ult needs to go to eight. No down. doubt in my mind. But they're both playing an elbow here. Oh, this timing is everything for Sadak. So often. Falling should be enough oh, yeah. of a Q. On the turn. Oh, had to insta cancel his ult. To push forward, feeling the walls closing in around him. A 1v1 now, still. the Molly to buy some time. Oh. QCK tanks it, he has no idea. Oh, he heard him. Footsteps betraying his position, oh and now the Nah, he's is way is too confident, man. Oh Dude, they're toying with him. For crashes, and the 10th for NRG. <laughs> Last round oh in the half. my gosh. This, this, is, this is ugly now. This is, this is savage. This is a roster right here. It is fully, fully over. It was oh, a while ago. I mean, Marv did great to get that kill yeah, and make it doable. Crashes the shot on sight is ridiculous. It, right? NRG, even with only like a couple weeks, Dude, this has been this yet. has been a life for so long. They, they gotta just put him in a position to use this all. Surely, so close. retake a away. retake Take a sight or something, or just insta pop. They lost it. With time under the belt, I mean, they look clean. I'm pretty sure I've only seen QCK use one ult. And the trades again. Flash. Ethan's been so, I mean, really, NRG from top to bottom have played this map so confidently. But Ethan really stands out in memory of how aggressively he's played, how confidently he's swung. And I think it goes back to what you were talking about earlier, the trades, yeah. the reliance that they have on each other and the confidence to take these fights and know that there's a good chance they're going to win them. They're so dialed in on... On the, on the basic thing. Big jewel over towards the middle. Damn, Prius is fully on it. Yeah. From Demon 1, another first blood. Keeps Every jewel, so they lose the middle. Into half time. Saving it for the second half, I guess. I don't know. Oh, <laughs> do we? Has found oh, oh boy. <laughs> they knew about the pocket mid. They don't know about this one. One, two, oh, no. Bro, the, the dizzy. <laughs> Nicely handed from Les. Can't believe the dizzy got him still. They double their rounds at the end. The chance. There's a chance. Small, minute chance. This is insane. And almost 
Yeah. To, 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 it, that was crazy because the dizzy flash was thrown forward and <laughs> it, it gooped backward. Happen. Look at Sa <laughs> he's vibing. Hey, we got one, boys. We got two. <laughs> yeah, I mean, the coach said they're just having fun with it. In positions play. like this, we're actually going to throw it down to Smix, who's standing by in the coach streaming booth. Thank you very much, Doug. Sitting here with the lovely Piplup Tiny, or Anita, as well as Kelly. Kelly, I'm going to start with you because I know you have a certain husband that is currently playing on the server right now. And uh, I have to think that the score is making you quite relaxed. Um, after watching Ethan play for all these years, I can never be like relaxed. So I'm not going to say anything. I'm just hoping for a good game. Okay, okay. I like that. I like that. Let's not jinx it. We, we don't want to jinx anything going on over here. And Anita, I know earlier on you were talking about how you're watching C9 and how it felt really nerve wracking. How much of that do you think is because A, Ascent was mind boggling and also B, you're here in the Riot Games Arena? I think it's both. The crowd is super loud and really energetic, so it's like adding to everything. And it was really hard to tell. Like, yeah, <laughs> it was, it's really hard to tell who's like gonna win the next round. But it's really exciting, and fun. I love that you guys are emotionally supporting each other for the different matches. Because had it been C9 <laughs> versus NRG, I don't know what would have happened on this co stream. Um, before I let you guys go, obviously we would love to see them be able to close it out, but we do see some interesting things happening with NRG this time around. Some new agents coming out from different players. What are your thoughts on that? Honestly, they've been doing a lot of shuffling and practicing in um, scrims, and I'm glad they're finally like solidifying like the agents that they're trying out and they have more reps, and I feel like along the season, it'll just get better. Love to hear it, love to hear it. And Anita, I know we saw earlier C9 be able to close it out, which bodes really, really well, especially with the roster changes that came in. What are you most looking forward to in the rest of the season? Um, I'm really looking forward to seeing how they skill and like experiment a little bit more. I know they said they were destroying during practice, so I really want to see that come out a little bit more <laughs> during the games. Maybe make it a little bit less stressful yeah. for you and the other C9 fans for now. Thank you both so much for taking the time for this quick interview. Let's head back to the casters. Thank you so much, Smix. Yeah, yeah. shout out to everyone in the house. We've got co-streamers. We have Tupperware who's here as well. Yeah. And it's a party, and I wish I could say it feels like a family-friendly show, but given what NRG are doing aloud, <laughs> I, I don't know that that's the case. Yeah, Maybe it's been pretty savage. Comeback, I like to... Um, I mean, the first map was really good. Really doesn't feel this like is... Be what plays out. It's just more... Loud on I mean, the they've just... Right now. They've, got the they've just wrecked them. The but they're going to be pushing into elbow. They're going to be pushing oh. into this crashy demon. Oh. Oh. Ah, it's so short. As as it's the, sh it's a short two. one. Oh, no, Doug. At least we got our class, close game for the first... Uh, I mean, best of three. Countine took some damage there. It's just not... D9 Lev worth watching. 100% the last map. No, and I think if, if this goes the way we think it's going to go, the way it seems like it's going to go, this will be four pistols for NRG. Unless Loud can pull off oh. something pretty ridiculous. And so far, this might have the makings of it. Calentine and two Wait, Omen left. should make sound here. The spike is still a bit further away. Is now oh, my God. Round. I mean, he's... He's back. Yeah. He's, I, mean, he, I mean, he never really... Solid, um, <laughs> so, like, solid first showing for his raise. And it's on raise. 18 and 8. I mean, he's trying to shut up everybody who thinks that he's just a jet and controller. Two trick. <laughs> now he can play the raise, too. I mean, the man can do it all. Wait, he's smiling for real. He actually, yeah, yeah. Oh <laughs> for real. Yeah, truthfully, yeah no plan on this one. They managed to go smile. for the force they buy. When I say manage, they don't get much out. They got three sheriffs double stinger. It was a close affair on Breeze, but this has been anything but... I hit the four. Thing about like playing at the internationals. I know we we spoke about a lot about. Well, they know where everyone is now after getting that kill, and with it, they take so much space. Marv is watching you play. Early and B main. See in real time what you like to do, what your tendencies are, because they have nothing better to do. Every single player is gonna dial in on that. I mean, let's be honest. There's a mouse bug. Doesn't even matter. Hey, ten chances, and this is gonna be a short one. I get my five hours after all. Yeah, you're not wrong. It's an absolute wash. Yeah. And if you're an energy fan, you, you're, you're happy. You're very happy right now because, on paper, we knew. Everyone knows on paper this roster is supposed to be one of the best teams in the game. 
but to actually see it happen live in front of you, to see the work that they've put put in in not that long of a time, I mean, this might be the start of a... No, dog, that's era. actually true. Well, energy. You know, I think, yeah, for as much as we've talked about this team on paper and how good they might be... The Man, they're just running it down A every oh, single round. I still think GCK is... <laughs> Swinging at this point, Legend has it. He's still <laughs> swinging all the way around. Less is weak. Two is healthy. Got a guardian, no armor. Marved and Victor left alone in a position to put the series away. Spam not gonna connect. Oh man, all under two is now. Yeah, he has full utility though. Yeah, um, Flash probably wins in this. A chance. Cover going out. To keep this going, but I honestly don't think that Loud can bring this one back completely. They're they're waiting. <laughs> they're Did he smoke time. off the spike? Victor's oh, managed no, to go not like this. Oh, he got him though. Yeah, but he's flashed. The counter paranoia is there. It's gonna buy a little bit of time. It's been half, but now Marv with a whole lot to do. And not a lot of time to do it. It doesn't matter. The <laughs> okay. Nicely done in the end here. Very, very dominant, like we said. First map was sick, though.